A new wildfire in El Dorado County has ballooned in size today, growing from 100 acres to 2,000. Mandatory and voluntary evacuations are underway. News 10's Carlos Arcedo is live from the community center in Pollock Pines, where evacuees are seeking shelter. Carlos. Well, 70, the fire is spreading and it's spreading quickly. Now, if you take a look behind me, you can see a thick plume of smoke in the air. More than 500 residents are under evacuation orders, both mandatory and voluntary. Now, people, many people have been coming here to the Pollock Pines Community Center for trying to get any updates about when they'll be able to return to their homes. Fire crews are on the ground and in the air trying to contain the keen fire in Pollock Pines. Several structures, including homes, are being threatened and evacuation orders in place. We're just, we're just ready. We're prepared. Jimmy Eustat's home is under a voluntary evacuation mandate, but she has seen the heavy smoke continue to grow and take over the skies. She's not taking any chances. So it's scary. We've got our trailers hooked up just in case. My daughter's here. I've kind of told her, take this, take that, you know, just basically my animals and um, my pictures is what I'm looking at. Throughout the day, the wildfire has grown in size and strength. Crews have been using fire retardant and water drops to control the flames. The firefighting efforts on the ground more intense with powerful flames pushing up on the canyon. El Dorado County hotshot crews are in the area trying to cut down trees, trying to reduce anything that could add fuel to this fire. They're also trying to work to build a control line, anything to help save structures like this home. The priority for firefighters, saving lives and homes. Uh, we were uh, reducing the fuel load. We are cutting down trees, uh, making a control line. It looks like a uh, dirt trail over here so that when the fire hit it, we are able to have a, a, land, a line to stand on. While firefighting efforts have slowed down the fire's progress, the winds have posed a challenge. For now, many residents are left hoping, praying their homes are spared and the evacuation orders lifted. Now, the American Red Cross is on scene here. They are in the process of moving the evacuation center to Sierra Ridge Middle School on Amber Trail. Again, that's just to accommodate the larger crowds. Many people, more than 500 people under mandatory and voluntary evacuation orders. So a lot of, you know, this little small area wasn't able to accommodate those big crowds. So they're moving the evacuation center. And many people are just wondering they'll, when they'll be able to return to their homes. Reporting live in El Dorado County, Carlos Salcedo, News 10.